So a few weeks back while I was down at a convention on the showroom floor, I got my hands on a brand new mouse that I was very impressed with. I, I love the design. I love the feel of it. Uh, I love the, the weight and the comfort in my hand. And, and most importantly, I love the feature set that it had. So I went down to pick one up um, and this is a great competitor for a Magic Mouse if you're using a Mac. Um, and it's also an awesome mouse that they have made for the Ultrabook line or you know these Windows 8 tablet uh, laptop systems that you have. It's a super portable, ultra lightweight, very feature rich mouse by Logitech. And this is actually the Logitech Ultra Thin Touch Mouse. Uh, I got the white one here, which is for Mac. They make a black one as well for your Windows based PCs. To be honest with you, I believe they're going to work with either of the units, just depending on what color you want and then which drivers you download. Uh, this one probably comes bundled with Mac drivers. I'm assuming the black one comes bundled with uh, Windows drivers. But let's crack this bad boy open and take a look at the features, and we'll talk about uh, some of the cool stuff that this mouse has in it. Stay tuned. That's next on Geek with Glasses. <laughs> Okay, here we have it, the Logitech Ultra Thin Touch Mouse. This is the model T631 for Mac. The T630 is the PC version of this mouse, and the only difference is black um, and, a, and a logo. I'm assuming this one has, like I said, uh, drivers specifically for Mac OS, and the Windows one will have Windows-based drivers. But uh, let's take a look at the box. So on the front, just your basic uh, uh, branding. You can see the, the mouse is inside this nice hard container. Uh, perfect complement for the sleek, good looks of your MacBook Pro and or MacBook Air or any other computer that you want to use it for. Um, on the right, we have the Logitech, uh, a Bluetooth logo. Uh, this does connect with Bluetooth, so no more using a USB dongle to uh, um, get this one to connect, unless you're currently using a Mac mouse, like a Magic Mouse, which uh, connects via Bluetooth as well. Super thin feather light, touch your way around, one mouse, multiple devices. We'll talk about that. This actually has a, uh, a, a number one and a number two switch, so you can actually sync this device, this mouse, with two different computer systems and toggle between the two, which I think is really cool. Um, charge over USB, which is really sweet. Um, internal battery pack within the uh, mouse that you charge with USB cable, micro USB. Um, ultra fine, oh, this is just a, uh, another language version of what we read over here on the bottom. Just a little bit of um, literature. So let's open this up and see what we get inside. We got some tape on the one side, and it looks like we got some tape on the other side as well. We'll pull that off and pop the top off of this, set that aside, and here we have the mouse. So we'll set that aside. This is, this is awesome. I love the feel of this mouse. I love how small and compact it is. Very cool feel. Let's set that aside and see what else we get in the box. So if we pull on this tab here, it pulls up a nice little plastic containering. They didn't scrimp when it came to the packaging, that's for sure. We've got... Uh, Ultra guide, uh, ultra thin mouse guide, setup and installation guide. Um, so it's just basic literature talking about the device um, and where to get uh, the different gestures that you can use, how to charge it, so on and so forth. Um, then we have important information, safety and compliance and warranty. We'll throw that aside and pull out. We also have a charging cable, I would assume. Yep. So we have a nice thin, very compact, USB charging, which uh, again, right here on the bottom. If you've already got a micro USB, you don't need to carry this around. Any micro USB will work. You just plug that in and uh, charge it up. One of the really cool things that uh, Logitech boasts about this mouse is due to the ultra lightweight compact design, um, the and, and the fact that it's obviously laser, one minute of charge will give you one hour of use under normal using user conditions according to uh, Logitech. So that's kind of cool. If you're in a hurry and your mouse is starting to die on you, you can charge it for a minute and use it for an hour. So very cool. Let's, uh, let's take a look at the mouse. So here we have it. Uh, get the uh, camera here to focus. Hopefully it's gonna focus sometime soon. Let's do this and there we go. Uh, come on, focus, there we go. So we've got Logitech branding and we obviously have a little LED. I would assume this is gonna indicate connection. On the bottom we have the on and off as well as that one, two, A, B switch. So two separate devices. So like I could have this sync to my Mac and I could also have this sync to my work computer. So I can just connect 
back and forth whichever uh, computer I want to use this single mouse on. Little connect button to create um, your Bluetooth connection. Let's take a look at the design. Got this really cool brushed aluminum, which obviously is meant to complement uh, a MacBook. And then the white, um, and this is kind of a soft touch feel. So a little bit of size comparison here. We got the Magic Mouse. I'll set it side by side. And we've got the T361 or 631. Significantly smaller, much more lightweight. Let's get that in frame. There we go. Um, I love my Magic Mouse, but at the same time, I hate my Magic Mouse. It's big, it's bulky, I don't find it very comfortable, and most importantly, I actually find it a kind of a pain in the butt to do these clicks. When I first got my hand on this mouse uh, at that convention I was at, one of the things was the simplicity of the clicks. Very light touch for the left and right click. You do have the same system with the Magic Mouse where you click the right hand side, for the right click and the left hand side for the left click and the entire surface is a touch surface which is configurable so there's a, a size difference and a weight difference massive weight difference i mean this thing is ultimate portability um, i'm going to go sync this up with my macbook and play with it and then maybe do a video real quick to show you what it looks like on the mac and the gestures that you get from everything that i've seen and what i was told by logitech you're going to get the exact same capabilities and all of the same gestures that you have with your magic mouse out of this Logitech mouse. So uh, let's go plug it in, take a look at it, and uh, see how it works. Stay tuned. As always, like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash geekwithglasses. Um, follow us on Twitter, twitter.com slash geekwithglasses. And you can find us on Google Plus as well. Um, just uh, you know, do the typical like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think about this mouse. If you have one, let me know what you're thinking about it and uh, how you like it. And stay tuned for a review video on how this mouse actually works. Thanks again and have a great day.